Hello, and welcome to Impossible Science, where the impossible It's a reality. So last week you guys saw some crazy, crazy tie-dye milk, and I asked you, what was causing the food coloring to make these designs in the milk? And I see that we have quite a few Einstein viewers making comments such as these. The simple explanation that everyone will understand is that the dish soap moves around and attacks the fat in the milk. And while this is going on, the dish soap also moves the food coloring around, creating some pretty funky designs. So let's move on with today's experiment. Today you're going to be doing the classic egg in a bottle experiment, but with a twist. Not only am I going to show you how to get an egg into a bottle without forcing it in, I'm also going to show you how to get it out. For today's experiment, you're going to need a hard boiled egg, a bottle, a piece of scrap paper, and something to light it with. Please be careful. Light the paper, drop it in, place your egg on top, and presto! Now here comes the cool part. Does anyone want some floor egg? This is a very well known experiment. And my question to you guys is what's causing an egg to shoot into the bottle? And what's causing it to shoot out? If you can't figure it out, don't worry because I'll reveal all in the next episode. And for all mantis, out.